the Irving Black Arts Council and the City of Irving team up once again to celebrate Black History Month with a special program. Lenita Johnson and Stephanie Dixon are here with the details. Welcome, guys. Thank, thank you. you. And thank you for highlighting us again this of year. Of course. Thanks for coming back. Sure. Lenita, last year was a huge success. Can you tell us about the theme and how it was? Oh yes, last year we was actually talking about and celebrating black health and wellness. Mm -hmm. That is very dear to the black community as everyone know. So we had a panel of doctors and uh, really uh, jokesters came in to tell jokes, our comedians, and then we just brought the community together to really have a conversation. We was coming out of COVID also. Yes. So, you know, limited audience, limited things we could do, but the conversation was very, very important. Mm -hmm. So that one was more informative, so to speak, but it was great. So this year we're following up on that with our new theme, Art and Purpose. Great, yeah. yes, no. yes, yes. So it's going to be great. I'm excited. Me too. Me too. Stephanie, can <laughs> yeah. you tell us what um, attendees can look forward to? Yes. Well, um, Stephanie Dixon with Styling Diva Productions, and we are the featured uh, entertainment, should I say? Yes. Uh -huh. <laughs> and so, <laughs> I have written a stage play called Black History Is on Trial. And so with that, it's a courtroom setting. We're going to have our witnesses that are going to take the stand. We have our opposing counsel who feels that um, black history should not be celebrated in the month of February, saying that those that we celebrate were defiant and uh, they were troublemakers. And then, of course, you have me. Mm -hmm. And <laughs> <laughs> I will be for black history being celebrated to let the, the audience know that, yeah, they were defiant. You know, mm -hmm. they did make some trouble, but it was good trouble, as John mm -hmm. Lewis would say. Yeah. So that trouble helped uh, black history and it helped America. You know, black history is American history. Yes, so a lot of what they did is, is, is history. So it's just history. Yeah, mm -hmm. very true, very true. So Lenita, why should people make sure they come to this event? I'm so glad you <laughs> asked that because it's not just about black history and the set, well it is all about that, but we also are gonna unveil the United States Post Office heritage stamp so the United States Postmaster will be there. We're gonna serve black desserts afterwards. So we're gonna Ooh. have like a little on the go reception because Sunday, every Sunday, mm -hmm. Folks know we go to church yes. and we have Sunday dinner. That's it. <laughs> so as you leave, please, des de uh, you deserve a little dessert. So <laughs> like we'll that. have that going on. And then Antioch Christian Church here in Irvine, we have dancers and mimes. So they're going to come in and do a presentation for us. We're celebrating. This yeah. is going to be fun. Yes. So the mayor, his staff, we've invited everybody. And I want the entire community to come together for this one day. But we've been celebrating it all month. Yeah. <laughs> all yeah. month. Yeah. <laughs> Sounds fun and delicious. Yes, yes. <laughs> Stephanie, what are you most looking forward to? <laughs> well, I'm just mostly looking forward uh, really to the audience hearing a lot of black history facts yes. that they may not have known. You know, we uh, we hear about Martin Luther King and uh, mm -hmm. Nelson Mandela and others, but we really want them to know what they did. It was more than just the I have a dream speech. Right. It was more than just yes. Nelson Mandela spending 27 years in jail. You know, mm -hmm. what was his purpose for going to jail? Why did he do it? Why did um, Martin Luther King stage the sit-ins and things of that nature that caused him to go to jail and not just that Maya Angelou we're going to mm -hmm. talk about we're going she's going to be one of our witnesses as well oh. and so <laughs> we're going and it's going to there's going to be some music and just history just black yes. history very important. Yes. No, that's yes. great. It sounds like a really great time. Yes. Guys, thank you so much for being here today. Definitely. So that's going to be Sunday in Dupree Theater at 3 p.m. I'm so excited yes. for everybody to come out. <laughs> yes, yes. <laughs> Folks, uh, you heard it. <laughs> the Black History Month program and reception will be on Sunday, February 19th at the Dupree Theater at 3 p.m. For more information, visit irvingblackarts.org.